This is Fox 5 News, live in Las Vegas. Okay. All right, thanks. All right, thank you. All right, I can say it, but one thing that's for sure is that women have better money-saving skills than men. Thanks, Dave. No, 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 that was in the teleprompter, Monica. <laughs> Whatever. Anyway, we have a guest up next live in studio to help women work on managing their money. Oh, still good. 10000 We're not at 8000 so I'm trying to look on the bright side. <laughs> All right, at 744, us women can manage the home really, really well and a whole lot of other things, but how do we fare when it comes to managing money? Women are said to think about everybody else's needs but their own. You know, that's nature for women. Anyway, my next guest says, take control of your relationship, your financial relationship, that is. She is economic and stock market analyst, Frances Newton. Frances, thank you so much for joining us. Good morning. Good morning. Okay, you know what? We can do everything, the house, the kids, the cars, the husband, all of that. But when it comes to money, we can save it. But sometimes it can be pretty intimidating, especially if you're working and you have to choose your 401k funds. I remember looking at mine going, what the heck should I choose? Give us the basics, Francis. Well, it's very important to get a... a a manager for your 401k that you can actually talk to. Yeah. And you want to ask them questions. Do they use mathematical analysis? Do they use techn te technical analysis? Mm -hmm. And the reason is, is because this market has completely changed. We're yeah. no longer in aggressive growth. Uh, computers are making 60 to 70 percent of the trades. Mm. So you definitely want to hedge your bets and you want to have a manager that understands how to do that. When you say hedge, what does that mean? What that means is that you take a certain percentage of your 401k and put it in a fund that actually goes up when the market goes down. And oh. for women, it's interesting, just take 10 or 15 minutes out of a day. Mm -hmm. You know, women are running all the time. And just think about your finances, whether it's your 401k, your FICO score, mm -hmm. you can go to myfico.com. Yeah. You know, little ways that you can improve. And it's definitely about progress, not perfection. Okay. Now, when you talk about savings accounts, a lot of financial analysts, in fact, uh, I talked to a financial analyst, it's been several months ago, and he was like, you know, putting your money in a bank in a savings account is a waste because the bank is making money off of your money. So they always, you know, go against that. Well, the problem is, is that when the interest rates are so low, it is yeah. really tough to find a great return. And when mm -hmm. the market is selling off. So this is definitely not about aggressive growth. And okay. I think people need to understand that. This market environment has changed because the economic indicators do not yet support full-on recovery. And so definitely hedge your bets, you know, okay. get some growth going mm -hmm. and get a bear fund and allocate your assets in different areas and talk to a fund manager that understands that. Ask questions. Don't yeah. be afraid to ask questions. Because it's your money. It's your money. All right. Thanks a lot, Francis. And so, okay, now right now, if I were to go into a 401k, right, mm -hmm. and I'm looking at it and I want to invest like the, the basic, the, the minimum, maybe right. like $100 per pay period, mm -hmm. what would be the best fund right now to invest in as far as hedging my investment? Um, I think that's how you say it. 401ks <laughs> all have particular funds that are available. Yeah. So you have to see what's available for your 401k, but every fund company um, has a hedge fund, a bear fund, okay. essentially, and they have aggressive growth funds. And they have, you know, triple X, double X, and so you can talk to your fund manager. Just make sure a percentage of what you're putting in every month yeah. actually goes up when the market goes down. So when we see another correction, which is inevitable in this yeah. cycle, as the velocity of money, money shrinks and uh, the stock market's going to sell off again. Okay. And then that way, you're just not headed down. Something you own is in the green. So Yeah, and if push comes to shove, call Francis for a loan. Yeah. <laughs> All right, thank you so much, Francis. We appreciate it. Thank 